I remember it like it was yesterday. We were only kids then, way too young to patrol that part of the river, especially behind enemy lines. We knew we were being watched, but we didn't know by whom or where. Until the shots rang out, and the firefight began. Napalm Joe took a slug to his gut right away. Poor guy never stood a chance. He died almost instantly. We chased the sniper over the river, but the coward ran off into the weeds before we could get a clean shot. As I recall it, now, we were further behind the enemy line, cut off from any help from headquarters. They didn't even know where we were. Machine gun Pete and I laid down covering fire, and I did my best with my pistol not to shoot my own foot. I almost got it, too. Old fire pin Freddy. He fired his gun until his barrel almost melted. Had to. It was us against 50 men, hiding in the bushes. Somehow we made it out of there, back down to the river, without a scratch on us. We spent what seemed like days crossing that river. The current was hard and high, almost took us under. Napalm Joe was alive again. Not quite sure how that worked out, but it was good to see him again. Sniper picked us off one at a time until there was no one left. I went down hard and died right there along with the rest of my men. No one survived. Now that I think about it, maybe it didn't happen that way. War has a funny way of messing with your mind.